been a little while, but it's a mail day. I got two packages of fun things. Very excited about. First one. COVID test free from the USPS. Thanks, USPS. Oh, heavens. This one must be from Italy. It says for GLA. Right, Mom? This was inside that envelope. Paper. <laughs> this. More paper. Freaking lunch. What are these? Oh, they are the most evil company ever. Oh, I hate you. And look at that. A handwritten freaking note that says, thank you, Mike. And this also says Ponzi Scheme Pin Company, which is questionable. I hope they're not really a Ponzi scheme. So let's open this little box. Oh, my God. I keep looking at the wrong place. Camera here, Marie. Camera here. Okay. Okay. In the box. Is a bag. In the bag. Is a bag. In the other bag is a little bottle of ink that has like wax seal on the top. And then in this long bag is a bag made of velveteen, very soft. Mm -hmm. By the way, sorry if you hear the noises outside, but that's how life works. Um, there are noises outside. And in this bag, oh. Is a little cylinder of acrylic. Can we focus on this for a minute, please? Phone, would you maybe like do that for me? If I go like that. Oh. My stomach just growled really noisily. It's because it's lunchtime. Um, so, you know what this requires? We got a new pen. This is a... Number six, Yovo, Yovo, Neb, I believe. I probably got it in broad because it's me. This pen is from, I didn't say, Woodshed Pens. Cap is a good size because I post the caps here when I write. <laughs> People talk about posting, right? That means like putting the cap on the back of the pen. Um, I wonder if this would be small for some people. Those people have hands that are too big. I love it. I love especially that it's not like 
like rounded. I like, you know, look, this pin is short and a little bit fat. Let's go clean it out real quick and put ink in it. Okay, I'm pausing you. So you're not even gonna notice. Well, I'll probably be in a different position when we unpause. Shh. Okay, we're back. Um, I realized like so much needs to happen, like, you know, swatchy goodness and all that because it's new ink also. But for you, um, let's open this. The ink, by the way, is by Papier Plume. I don't know if I said earlier. And if I did, I got it wrong. So the color of this is Mermaid's Tears. The color of the pen. Wait. We did not get a thing to wipe the nib. Almost had a problem on our hands. Back. No, don't you dare slide. Why well, I got a really full fill. Funnily enough, I don't usually like doing that because I like to change my inks up a lot. But I emptied three or four pins this week. Big like writing with them, not like, there's only one that I like rage quit. So what do you need to know about this pin? The material is Illumilite by Jonathan Brooks called Mermaid's Tears. Pen itself is Woodshed Pins. This is V2. So I think what happened is like they made V1 and then once everything sold out and it was all received, they had some leftover. And here we are with this beautiful Mermaid's Tears. The ink is also called Mermaid's Tears. I have a thing here. This is what I'm treating as my uh, ink journal. So like I'm writing down when I fill a pen, which I really like having. What's today? I think it's the 27. Wait, I should know because I wrote down what day I emptied a pen just a minute ago. 425, 426, 427. Well, I just, look, I just screwed up the name of the woodshed here, Pins, Mermaid, Holy cow, y'all, I can't write. I'm not gonna write. I was gonna write it in my other book. But I made like two mistakes writing, just like, so it's not happening. So here we go. There's the ink. The pen is lovely. It writes well. Heavens, it's just beautiful phone. Why won't you capture its beauty? It's magnificent. Anyway, uh, thanks for hanging out. Uh, thanks to Woodshed Pins for the, oh, butterfly went by, for the amazing pin and also for the snacks because now I know what I'm doing for lunch. 
Now that I have lunch, I usually do like one meal a day. And so probably my one meal a day should not be like Intamin's or Rice Krispie Treats. And I'm probably responsible enough that it won't be. Maybe it'll be dessert though. Hope you're having a wonderful day.